Okay, you guys, I'm literally filming this on my bed, so I'm going to try not to move very much because <laughs> um, it'll be wobbly. But hi, guys, my name is Rebecca Varney. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am a mom. I live in Utah, and my son is two and a half. He's going on three, actually. He has just a few more months, and he'll be three, which is insane. <laughs> I also have this tea that I'm drinking right now, and I'll explain this tea later. All right, you guys, so I just want to kind of give you like a little life update on what's going on in my world. So this is basically like a wellness vlog slash life update because I want to share what I'm doing with my health. And my son's in there watching TV, so he might come in and interrupt us every now and again. But I wanted to start you guys off with saying that I am on a serious journey right now. Uh, and it's basically just to kind of get my body like to be not inflamed anymore, like my cells, because I was gifted this coaching session. Um, my sister gifted me this co coaching session with this guy who basically told me in a nutshell, like after going all over all my health stuff that with also doing a urine analysis, he told me that my body and my cells are very inflamed and I need <laughs> like inflammation, you know? and I need to take that seriously. And he said, you know, at any moment you could have a heart attack or any moment you could, um, you know, kick up autoimmune issues or something like that. And I already know like health wise that there's stuff going on with me. Like I can tell by the rashes that pop up on my skin. I have like really bad scratchy legs and itchy legs, itchy dry skin. So I already know I have some stuff going on, but I also have felt it in my heart and I just decided to like, you know, kind of get that figured out. I, I want to see what's going on. So that was the beginning of my little journey there of trying to figure out like what was going on with me and what I could do to change it. So the first thing that I decided to change was my diet because I mean, food is medicine and I think about, I'm already working out, right? I'm already eating organic. So what else could I possibly do that's different that is like making me inflamed? I, I could never, I could never figure it out. Um, I also have H. pylori, if you guys know, and I still have it. I'm currently doing things to try to help that. And I plan to talk further about that later, but I decided to like cut out red meat because red meat causes a lot of inflammation. Um, I just looked up things that cause inflammation. Basically, it's simple. Like you just Google it and you can discover like what causes inflammation in your body. Uh, on top of changing my clothes, like so I've started to order more organic like cotton clothing. And I've also gotten rid of like mostly all the plastics in my home besides like our drinking water, which is definitely something we're working on. It's just a jug with purified water in it. But we are working on removing all the plastics in our home and trying to get me like better clothing to wear. Even my, my husband, I want to get him better clothing eventually. But this stuff costs money and it takes time. So we realize it's going to take a while to like completely change everything. And that's totally fine. Like if you're in the same position where you're like, I'm looking to get healthier and I want to go more non-toxic, then definitely just realize that it's going to probably take you time unless you're like wealthy, <laughs> you know, unless you can do it all once. I mean, that's great. So I would love that, but I can't. So moving on. Um, what am I doing differently? I'm basically just, I'm walking every day because I heard that can help with inflammation. I do Pilates, which I was already doing for the last year or two. I can't even remember how long I've been doing that from the form app. So I've been doing that for a very long time and I love, love, love Pilates. It's my favorite workout besides just walking. <laughs> so I've been walking every day for about 30 minutes a day. And I think that's really helping except for like days like this when it's like really rainy and if it's snowing, which it's spring now, but it was still snowing today. Thanks Utah weather, just weird stuff. But I love walking and that is something I look forward to doing all this spring, summer and fall if I can help it. So the next thing on my list, you guys, is to talk about the H. pylori. And that is basically a stomach bacteria that's aggressive that gets down into your gut lining and can create all kinds of issues like 
SIBO and autoimmune issues. It basically just gets, it dives down deep into your stomach lining. It can create major problems. So that is something that I have dealt with now for pretty much two years. And I took the whole round of antibiotics only once and I got a major like reaction to it where my skin was just rashy and itchy and it was just horrifying and it lasted for you know I took the round of antibiotics for about 12 days before I stopped because I called them like is this normal like I don't think this is normal and they're like no you need to stop so they gave me something else and I never went to the pharmacy and got it because I thought to myself well if I'm going to try to conceive then I'm going to wait and um, the only thing I can think to think to do like while we're trying to conceive is the Matula tea. And I don't even know if that's like okay, but it's antioxidant. It's a green tea that's all caffeine free. So I thought it's a tea, you know, and it might be a detox tea, but I thought to myself, like, I want to be my best self. I want to be healthy, but there's no way I'm going to be going on antibiotics while trying to conceive like that's stupid. Uh, so I am literally committing to one month of drinking this tea. It's a $200 tea. It's called Matula tea and it's from the Philippines, I think, or something. So you can get it shipped over and it's just honestly been okay so far. No complaints. I do it twice a day. I drink this on an empty stomach morning and night and you got to drink before you eat like an hour before. Um, so then the next thing I want to talk about is trying to conceive and I know I'm kind of rushing through this is because I have a toddler and he's gonna come in here at any moment so I we're still trying to conceive you guys may have known this but I had a loss back in January we found out we were pregnant before Christmas which was seriously beautiful and perfect and then we had a loss on the 6th of January and then um, we've been trying ever since <laughs> and I'm hoping and praying that it happens soon because I ain't getting any younger but that's just my thoughts on that. Um, but like I said, like we are trying to conceive and I'm, this is the only thing I'm doing to try to help my gut, which leads me to the next thing that I genuinely think is going to be freaking great. Um, but before that I did want to share, I do love the Pilates workouts. If you guys are interested in that, you can check out the form app. I don't get anything from that. I don't get paid from that at all. Like it's just something that I do like it's her name is Sammy Clark and her app is amazing okay lastly because my battery is gonna die already I know it I joined a company called Oliveda and it's basically just this amazing beautiful company from Europe they've been established for 20 years they're all waterless organic uh, products made from olive trees I can never remember the name <laughs> hydroxy I can look it up um, and then it's also called the elixir. So those are the two ingredients that are changing lives. And so the founder of the company actually, his name's Thomas, and you guys can totally look this up with olive tree people. But basically this guy healed his body in six months with this stuff. And it's just insane, insanely amazing. Okay, it's called the hydroxy tyrosol. It's the skincare industry's best kept secret because it is anti-inflammatory, anti-cancer, and it protects the skin and eyes. And I could go on about that. So what I'm doing is that they have these things called internals. And basically, like, especially the IO-1, I can't wait to take that because that's what this guy took, Thomas, uh, for six months to heal himself from literally almost dying. You know, he was going to die. Yeah. <laughs> and he started taking this. And this is why he's like, I got to get this out there in the world. Like the olive tree is healing, you know? And to me, it's very spiritual and biblical because there's just a lot of healing properties that come from the olive tree. And I think it's incredible. So with that said, this company, Oliveda, I just joined it like a few weeks ago and I just got some products today. I'm obsessed. Like I'm, I'm so excited to be able to share this product with everyone and what I'm most excited about, you guys, is the internals, like I said before. And I plan to heal my gut problems with this stuff. That is my prayer. That is my hope. I, I hope that it just goes in there and attacks this H. pylori because that's what it says it will do. It's saying it's going to go in there and attack anything that's causing disruption in your gut. So if you're watching this and you're like, 
I need something like that, I would highly recommend you trying the IO1 and I can put my link below if you guys are interested in trying it. If you become a consultant, you can save 25% off all your orders and you don't have to sell, but I highly recommend if you're looking for something to do that you can make money, that you can you can sell this. It's great. And it's a great opportunity to do that if you're just working from home or if you have extra time working at home or if you're a mom like me, it's perfect for you. So uh, I no longer do the other company that I was with for three years called Monet. I just don't, I, I stopped doing it a while ago and no beef there, I just stopped doing it and I found this other company that I just can really, really get behind and it aligns with where I'm at in my life for my health and all the things that I see for my skin and my future. So yeah, I, I, I don't know if that's all. Um, I feel like I can share more later with you guys. If you're interested in hearing way more about these products, you can follow me on Instagram or TikTok. I have those linked below. I'm pretty sure I have TikTok link below. If not, I will link that below. And you can see that I will be starting to upload like product knowledge and just kind of get you guys more familiar with the products and the ingredients so you feel comfortable about taking it too. I'm out there to help you just as much as I'm out there to help myself. Um, I uploaded a TikTok video about my H. pylori and I got like 5,000 views. So I assume that there's a lot of people out there that are struggling with this that need it. And if you're not out to want to drink the tea every day, maybe this is something you can try, the IO1. And it could be good for you. So I'm trying it and I will definitely give you guys a review if I think it works. And I'm very excited to go down this route in this journey to see like how it affects my body and what it heals because my skin needs it. So thank you so much for checking out my channel. I'm sorry I'm not very like, I'm not moving at all because I, I feel like a stiff bug because I'm trying to keep the camera still. <laughs> but that's it. I love you guys. Thank you for watching my videos. I know I don't put very much out there anymore, but I do every now and again and that works for me. So <laughs> if you guys want to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe, I would really appreciate it. Okay, bye.